Hi, welcome back today. In today's video, we will ask you a question and let you have 3 to 4 seconds to answer to check if you are prepared enough for your citizenship exam. Please watch till the end for the best preparation. Let's get started. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? 1. July 4, 1776 1. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4 What is the economic system in the United States? Capitalist economy What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Who is the governor of your state now? What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution Who is in charge of the executive branch? The President During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism Who signs bills to become laws? The President What does the President's Cabinet do? Advises the President
The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. Name your U.S. representative. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? The Louisiana Territory. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Joe Biden. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. Who was president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Kevin McCarthy. What is the capital of your state? What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of religion. Freedom of speech. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Kamala Harris. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. Who makes federal laws? Congress. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Announced our independence from Great Britain. What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution. Who 
Who does a U.S. senator represent? All people of the state. How many amendments does Constitution have? Twenty seven. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Missouri River. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the slaves. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. James Madison. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. When was the Constitution written? 1787. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. We elect a president for how many years? Four. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? Today.
April 15. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. What is the political party of the president now? Democratic Party. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil Rights Movement Under our Constitution some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Provide schooling and education. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. How many U.S. senators are there? One hundred. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Civil War. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? Four hundred thirty five. Who was the first president? George Washington. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War I. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Fought for civil rights. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote.
Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. Name one U.S. territory. Guam. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote. Join a political party. Who is the commander-in-chief of the military? The president. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. Name two national U.S. holidays. Thanksgiving Day. New Year's Day. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. What are two cabinet-level positions? Attorney General, Vice President. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Cherokee. Name one state that borders Mexico. Arizona. There were 13 original states. Name three. New York. New Jersey and Pennsylvania. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States?
Pacific Ocean. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Obey the laws of the United States. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Serve on a jury. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House of Representatives. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. In what month do we vote for president? November. What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for women's rights. Who vetoes bills? The president. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. When must all men register for the selective service? At age 18. Who is the father of our country? George Washington. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? U.S. Diplomat.